Hey guys, this is IX Rollout IX with Rollout Reviews bringing you another Let's Build. Today we are building the final Bionicle 2015 set that I've got at the moment. I still don't have the protectors, but built all of the Toa, and now it is time for the Lord of Skull Spiders. I have all the Skull Spiders from the Toa here. It's nice having a little army of these guys, it's really fun. But, of course, they need a leader. So, Here's the packaging here. Once again, has a little comic there. This golden mask, which uh, we're still not entirely sure what that is. So, yeah, I'd like to find out here. Maybe it's a mask that controls all the skull spiders, or I don't know, who knows? Anyway, let's cut right into this. Once again, this is one of the smaller sets here, uh, like Liwa and Gali and Pohatu, but uh, it has many more pieces than any of the Toa. It's still at a $15 price range, but it has lots of small parts, so it's, it is really worth it uh, for the parts count, I think, and I haven't even built it yet. So, let's close up this box here. Well, Onua was the most complex of the Toa. I do think that of the first wave, Lord of School Spiders is definitely the most complex. So hopefully it's not too much of a problem to, to build here. Um, hopefully we don't get confused and this video ends up being longer than it should be. Anyway, you got the instructions there. Uh, this looks like the same comic that was on the back there. And then you got the guy here sorting out the pieces, which of course we're not gonna do, which is probably an absolutely awful idea when it comes to the Lord of Skull Spiders because of how complex he is in comparison to the Toa. Let's bring the camera down a little bit here. Got a little box that has the uh, rubber band in it. He does have like a an attack function here. Come on, there we go. And uh, yeah, he uses a rubber band. So that's in the box so that it doesn't get mangled or something of that nature. Uh, let's open this up if we can. Should we just rip it open? Yeah, why not? Let's just rip it open. Okay. Is it just one rubber band in there? Yeah, what the heck? It's just a single rubber band in there. I would think there'd be at least an extra, but apparently not. Okay, um, you do get the golden Skull Spider mask, like we mentioned, that looks pretty cool. Really no different from any of the other uh, Skull Spiders though, as far as molding goes. It's got these nice, like, trans-orange lift arm pieces here. Uh, where's the face? Yeah, there that is, spooky scary. Spooky, spooky scary. Okay, so. We should probably uh, should probably start building this guy. Let's put that off to the side. We won't need the mask, so let's put that off to the side for right now as well. And jump right into this guy's creation. This will definitely be the most interesting out of any of them, uh, just because of its supposed complexity here. So, I suppose we'll find out. First, of course, put these together. Lots of Technic parts here, which is nice to see. It's it's nice that Bionicle isn't going to be, you know, solely CCBS like most of the Toa are. I mean, of course they have their own little Technic parts, but especially with the Lord of Skull Spiders, it's nice to see. So, now, put this together like that. Next, we take one of these pieces and then slide this through here like that. It's bringing back memories of like building some of the uh, some of like the uh, <clears throat> vehicles in in Bionicle. You know, lots of lift arms and things. Of course the Rahi. I actually never got any of the Rahi. Um, I might at some point, I might go back and get them, but uh, who knows, you know, at this point, you know, they might, because Bionicle's coming back and now all the uh, original sets are deemed Gen 1, people might be selling the sets for, for much more than they used to go, so uh, getting some of the 01 Rahi could be, could be a chore, but uh, hopefully not. Um, anyway, I never got any of the 01 Rahi. I did get Gadak and Kadak though, the Borok Queens, and they have a lot of lift arms on them as well. 
So, this is gonna go through this like that. And these attach here. I have no idea where any of this is going. Like it, <laughs> right now it's just kind of a mess of pieces. Uh, we need the other one of these pieces, these new, new pieces here. Well, like I said, I, I think they were in like some of the Lego movie sets. I think they were in like the sea cow and uh, like, uh, what's that other one? The Emmett's construction mech, that too. I could be wrong though, but I seem to remember that. Anyway, uh, now we need this piece. This is another piece I haven't seen personally. I don't own. Looks like a, a pretty cool thing. I, I could probably use these on, use this on some of my uh, Lego Transformers at some point. Um, I don't know how. I'd have to get more of them too, because it looks like this guy only comes with one of them. But um, it seems like a pretty useful piece. Um, okay, and then this attaches here, like that. It's got this thing going on, apparently. Next, we're going to take this, and there will be one of these pieces here. These little rubber band ball things. Then this is going to sit right here. And this is going to slide through there. Like that. Ooh, you got one of these. Now I think one of these is completely new. Yeah, either this one or that other one we saw in, in gray is completely new. As I drop that on the floor here. Um, I believe. Once again, could be wrong, but I think so. Uh, anyway, this is a very cool piece, um, and if I and if I did mock with with Bionicle parts, mock with Technic, I would definitely find that extremely useful. Some really cool parts in this new series. Now, we're going to take this rubber band and loop it around there, and then loop it around this piece. So, yeah, you got you got something going on here. Something's happening. Something is definitely happening. Anyway, um, then, now for something completely different. Okay, so I set this over here for right now. Gonna need one of these, and one of these, one of these. I'm, I'm really finding this fun because it's not quite as straightforward as all of the other, you know, Toa were. Um, most of them, like, they were each built very differently, but it was the same basic idea, you know? And I'm really finding this fun because it's something completely, completely new. All right, now this goes here or here. Yeah, like that. And then this piece goes here. Again, we have something happening. Possibly? Maybe? I don't know. I have no idea what's happening right now. But I'm sure it'll make sense at some point. Okay, now... Ooh. Ooh, okay. You got those. <laughs> kind of just like messing with it as I build it. Uh, this is all very... All very interesting. Okay, so we flip this around here now. Uh, oh no, did I use one of the wrong pieces? I think here, I think this is supposed to go here instead of this. So let's see if I can, uh, oop. Let's see if I can replace this without too much. There we go, this is our first mistake. Well, our first mistake was trying to build it on camera. Our second mistake was having that piece uh, there. <laughs> so, here we go. I think that's right. And now I have to, now I have to, oh wait, no, is it right? No, 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 it goes this way. Okay, and then we have to loop this back around here and loop, loop it back on this piece. Yikes, okay, all right, all right, we're back, we're back in good shape. 
Um, now, gonna do more crazy stuff. These go together. I believe they're two of the same ones. And we build this twice. So you got your four long axles, I believe. Yeah, those are four long. And then put them on either side of this. Where is... There one. There's one. Okay. And then the yellow piece goes on there. Like that. And then these... Whoop, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, whoa. Alright, these go in there like this. Yes? Are we a go? I believe so. Now we set this off to the side again. There's a lot of that. There's a lot of that going on here. Um, and... Hmm... I feel... like... I did something wrong again. Yes, I did. You know what? We screwed up at the very front. At the very start of this, we screwed up by using this piece instead of this piece. So, I'll be right back. All right, we are back. We fixed it. That was extremely tedious. I kind of had to take the entire thing apart. That always happens when I build very like, you know, not not very, but like more complex like Technic beam uh, sets. <laughs> like every single time I have to go back and do something again. Like that was not nearly as bad as like building the uh, Axelara from 2008. Uh, when I was building that, oh, that, that thing's huge and has so many parts and, and little tiny pieces. And I accidentally like did something wrong very early on and practically had to disassemble the entire thing to get it working again. Uh, it was a nightmare. But here's this. And we are going to Start putting on these pieces. So, yes, yes. This all seems right so far. I haven't screwed it up too much yet, yet, except for that once. But you didn't see anything. None of that happened. Anyway, so you got these. It's starting to kind of look like a spider, sort of, maybe. <laughs> maybe not. Uh,. Now, now, take this, and then plug this on here, and then this will slide, where is this going to slide? Slide on here, like that. Okay, great, and now we build something completely different. This is happening a lot with this. We're, uh, you know, starting to build something, adding it on, and then building a new thing. Kind of like a Lego set. C kind of like a Lego set. You know, uh, I I'm starting to catch on that this might be... This might be a Lego set. Okay. Uh, this goes on here. And then this... Where is, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. That yeah, goes on there. Like that. Turn the page. Turn the page with me. If you are building this along with me, uh, you know, if you're from the future, if you are from from the, the, the distant or not so distant future, and you have this set, or, or you know what, I guess you don't need to be in the distant future to have this set if you did get them on Walmart when they were there uh, for that accident that happened when I got all these sets, then um, if you're building this alongside me, I doubt you are, I doubt anybody is, maybe, uh, you're probably shaking your head, and you should be. You probably should be, because I'm uh, not doing very well here. Okay, yeah, <laughs> I have to take that off here. Get a little ahead of myself once again. I, I do that a lot, don't I? Okay, so here we go. Plug that on there. Put this on there. And then put that on. So we have kind of like this assembly. Sort of, um, yeah. Next, we flip it around, 
and then plug this on here. Now, now hopefully things starting, things are starting to make sense because this attaches here. Like this, come on, come on, go, go, there we go, ha, 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 what, wait, what, did, what, okay, and then this, attach it, what, hello, hello, is that you, um, okay, then this slides on here, <laughs> I'm sorry, oh, hey, look, oh, hey, look, it's doing a thing! Yes! <laughs> it's starting It's starting to actually make sense now. Okay. Alright, so it gives a little diagram. One-to-one -one diagram here. Are we doing it? Are we doing it well? Is that good? Is that good? Looks about good. So now, we can take this and plug this on here. <laughs> Oh, uh, this is a train wreck, but uh, hopefully somebody's enjoying this because at this point I'm uncertain if I even am. All right, here we go. There we go. Boom, boom, boom. That's doing a thing that it should. Next, we take these pieces and we're going to make a little jaw for Mr. Lord of Skull Spiders. So these attach here. And then attached to this little little new piece I was talking about earlier. Move the lights here just a little bit. There we go. All right. Next, we need little arm pieces. Here we go. Now these attach here. Let me take these little bits and put them on here. And now what? All right, these are where his six legs go. You know, none of these spiders are actually spiders. Uh, all of the uh, skull spiders, well, put that on backwards. All the skull spiders have four legs and the Lord of Skull Spiders has six legs, none of which are eight legs. For the better or the worse. Um, so there's that. Now we can actually put this faceplate on here. Whoops. There we go, just like that. So he's got a spooky scary face. We're getting into spooky scary territory at this point. So uh, brace yourselves. All right, now we're going to do this six times. And this will go on each one of the legs. So <laughs> get used to this for at least four more times here. Three, four, five, six. And then this will go there. That'll go there. This will go there. And the same on the other side. Eep. There we go. And there we go. All right. Mostly harmless. I didn't get anybody killed, so. At least there's that. At least there's that. All right, now we're gonna take these little bits. I love these pieces, by the way. These are such good pieces for like bionicle mocking. Again, I I'm not really into that too much, but from like what I've seen, and, and I can only imagine how good this piece could be if used well. But once again, I'm gonna be doing the same thing six times here. Only twice more, though. Eh, get in there. Eh, there we go. And 
there we go. Last one here. Just like that. Next, I'm gonna take these pieces. Are these new? I don't think so. I, I asked the same question in, in the Liwa, Liwa build, but I don't think those are new. Again, I don't have, I usually do research on these kind of things, but uh, I don't have my computer handy, obviously, and I probably wouldn't check even if I did, because I'm making a video, and that's that's not a thing I do during videos. That happens before videos. Anyway. All right, we got ourselves a spooky scary going on here. We're getting close to spooky scary if we aren't there already. Now, okay, now we're going to do the same thing six times again. That's the problem when you have a, a set <laughs> that has six legs. You got to do a lot of the same thing six times. Okay, and then we got two little uh, extra grabby teeth here. Oh, whoops. Hey, look, we're actually almost done with this guy. Didn't even notice. Uh, two little things there. And then some here, apparently. Lots of little teethy things on him. And then... Did I use the wrong? I think I did. I think I'm supposed to use these little little teeth for his teeth down here. Gosh dang it. All right. All right. All right. Most of this video is going to be backtracking. Well, probably not. But we do got to take these off here, I believe. And actually put the actual ones on. Just like so. If I'm wrong, then let's just say I'd hate to be wrong. Okay, there you go. Got those on there like that. Again, that that's the that's the worst part about making these videos is that like if I screw something up and you're watching me screw something up, then well, I mean there's nothing you can do about it. You just have to watch me fail until I realize that something has been screwed up, which is probably way after you figured out the same thing. This actually attaches like this. Although I guess only people who built the set themselves would know that. So if you haven't, and you haven't looked at the instructions, because you can't see the instructions here, then you, you'd you know. Anyway, all right, now this back piece, what? doesn't actually say where it attaches. It just shows it attached. But I think it goes like this. I think. Oh, wait, no. Might go like this. Yes? All right. Well, that looks, that looks, that looks right. That... That looks right. And so now you have the the Lord of Skull Spiders. Well, that was certainly a thing. Uh, that much I can say. Uh, actually, I think it does go on like this. Looking at the picture better there. Yeah, there you go. So there's the Lord of Skull Spiders. Uh, he is he's, he is a, a spider. Uh, sort of. Actually, he's not even quite a spider, and he does this thing. He does he does that? So, so for what's that? For what that is worth, he actually has quite a few uh, extra pieces here. You have one of these things, and one of these things, and a couple teeth, and then a pin and a thing. So there's that, and then there's the golden mask. And then there's there's the box. So that is about it, guys. And this is IX Roll at IX signing off.